Hello guys, welcome back to another video. Today we are doing our haul video. It has been a while since I've done a haul video. Um, this is probably the smallest haul I've ever done. As you can see here, I've got three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine titles uh, to actually get into. Very small haul. Most of mine in the past have been a lot bigger than this, but we are where we are. I'm back Blu-ray hunting though, so there has been some videos up. So if you have missed them, please go and check them out. But let's get into the haul for March 2023. Let's go. So I'm not going to do the breakdown of where I've got certain things from. I'm just going to go through the stack and then we will see what we what we picked up. Um, yeah, there's a few here. Really, really pleased with what I picked up this month. Um, a lot of like contributions from you guys as well. Um, and yeah, so I've got four 4Ks. So I think I'll start with the 4Ks and then we'll go into the Blu-rays. Um, the first one being... Cruella de Vil. Now, I already bought this. Um, I just wanted the slipcover because it was minty and it was only six quid in CEX. Um, and I think I traded my other one in for like five. So like this this cost me like a pound. Um, yeah, slipcover life, but I've got every single Disney slipcover. Um, apart from one, actually. So if anyone has it, let me know. Tangled. I need that slipcover. Um, but everything else, I've got them all. So, uh, so yeah. Um, but there's that one, Cruella, a film that I definitely got to revisit at some point because everyone says that I need to check it out and I didn't give it a fair shot really from the, the last time I watched it. So there's Cruella that I need to give another go. Next then we have another 4K. I actually picked this up from HMV. It was one of the 9.99s with any purchase. And this of course is Scream, Scream 5. One of my favorite Scream films actually. And um, to get it for 9.99 is a definite must. Um, this will be a franchise that I definitely will want to watch around Halloween time. Every year really, I'm really pleased that I've, I've got into these films. And number six is arguably going to be one of my favorite films of the year. So we will definitely be getting number six as well. So this is kind of why I wanted to pick this one up. I'm not too bothered about getting numbers. I've got number one, but number two, three, and four. I'm not too bothered about getting those on 4K. But the newer ones I definitely want to get, especially for good prices. So um, I definitely picked up Scream 5 there from HMV. So, uh, so there's that. Um, and I also picked up from HMV at the same time, uh, Top Gun Maverick. Now this was on a £20 deal, I think, from 25 So the two were like two for 30 um, That was my thinking. Um, yeah, a film I want to see. I still haven't opened this. i got to give this another go because um, this Blu-ray is apparently one of the best looking um, like 4K discs out there. So definitely want to give this another go and um, and, and see the quality of it and, and all that. Um, but it really, really, you know, a good film, well-made film, but not really my cup of tea in terms of genre. Uh, but we'll give it a go uh, again and, and see the quality of it. Maybe you'll blow me away, like the speakers and stuff like that. So, so yeah. Next then we have another 4K and this one is the newest and worst Fantastic Beasts movie. This is the Fantastic Beasts Secrets of Dumbledore. This was actually purchased from Big Pauly. Um, I actually purchased this, seems like what, ages ago now, but it's the beginning of the month. And um, yeah, like I've been looking for this for a while. I'm assuming, I think Pauly's got like the steelbooks, so he was selling his Amory and perfect for me what I needed. So um, yeah, really pleased with this. So cheers Paul for sending this out and um, you know, Thanks so much for a good price and all that. So, yeah, if you, if you want to check out Paulie's uh, Facebook group, you definitely should because he often puts up, like, deals and stuff that he's selling and, uh, yeah, managed to get this. So, really pleased to finally now have all the Fantastic Beasts movies, however rubbish they are. <laughs> so, there we go then. There is the 4Ks. I'm pretty pleased with the, the 4Ks so far this month. Really good. Um, You know, continuing on, slowly getting back into my, my movies and buying movies again. So... You know, it's good to fledge out the 4Ks even more. Now we've got um, some more Blu-rays to get through. Uh, the first we, ones we have are some um, some horrors. One being The Visit. This was a £3 pickup from a CEX. Um, good film. Seen this on Netflix uh, a while back, but uh, looking forward to giving this a uh, another watch at some point. Uh, M. Night Shyamalan movie. And many of you have known that I want to do like director-specific stuff. Um, and M. Night is definitely something I want to do, as well as Quentin Tarantino. I'm actually really close to Quentin Tarantino, but like before, obviously, all my stuff was happening, I was I was set on that. So maybe I need to pick that back up and see where, which ones I'm missing, because, yeah, I'm going to do that. Uh, next name I also picked up, then, It Follows for the great slipcover. Um, I just want to check as well, because um, there is apparently a reverse uh, cover in this, thanks to um, the movie Insider. So, oh my god, it is. So there is the reverse cover. That is pretty cool. 
I do prefer the other cover mind, but yeah, I mean, that may mean more in the movie because it looks like a tattoo of some kind, but yeah, pretty cool. I definitely would not have noticed that though if uh, it wasn't pointed out. So it's one of the good things about doing YouTube. <laughs> the people point out things for you that you just wouldn't have noticed. So, uh, so yeah. Um, but I'm pleased to pick this up. I want to get more horrors in the collection. I've started to watch a lot more horrors of late. Um, so I just want to just keep that up and just chuck a horror on every now and again whenever I fancy it. I'm pretty hard now. I can watch horrors on my own. I'm pretty I'm hard as nails. Um, <laughs> next then we have um, one of my well, beloved films, really. Philomena. Now, I thought I bought this. Somebody commented saying I'm sure I bought it, but I can't find it anyway. So I don't think I did. But Philomena is one of my favourite films and to get it in this minty slipcover is great. And I think this was 50p. So I'm really pleased uh, to get this in. One of my favourite films, um, you know, British films as well. Steve Coogan as well as Judy Dench. Um, and based on a true story as well. Um, so I'm going to be watching this again and revisiting that on the channel 100%. Uh, two left then now uh, and then we'll get to the end. Uh, the first one being um, LA Confidential. This is a movie that um, nominated for Oscars in 1997 apparently. And um, yeah, you guys recommended this. Um, starring um, Kevin Spacey, Kim Bazinga, Danny DeVito, Russell Crowe. Massive names. I've never seen it, never really heard of it before doing this YouTube channel. And here we are, you guys have recommended it. So that is going to be coming on a new series coming very, very soon. So stay tuned for that. And finally, another one that was on my top list um, that I needed to check out. And this is Under the Skin, starring Scarlett Johansson. Scarring? Starring Scarlett Johansson. I know nothing about this film. The cover is that and the back is very much like an arrow. Uh, release you know I mean you can't tell there's no pictures the disc is black I don't know anything what it's about I'm gonna go into this blind and um, and come out hopefully amazed um, but that is the under the skin movie that I need to check out uh, very very soon so yeah so there it is all in all eight pickups uh, or nine pickups sorry for the month and um, I did pretty well to get back into it you know it's really hard sometimes to pick something back up after you haven't done it for a while obviously my hauls are normally much longer than this much bigger more videos more more blu-rays rather to check out but you know we are where we are we're trying to grow the channel again and um, and yeah all your support is great thanks so much for watching today's video stay tuned for more videos coming soon and don't forget to smash that like button down below so this goes to more people so more people can love movies with James there we go thanks guys I'll see you in the next one goodbye